How do you do, fellow kids? What? But that's all right. Hush. Hey guys, it is Tristan with Nerdette's Newsstand, and we are talking about something probably everybody's talking about today, but we have to, we have to, we have to. It is so bad. We are going to talk about the Powerpuff Girls. Let me tell you my meet cue with the Powerpuff Girls. I don't know much about the Powerpuff Girls. I remember seeing them on, I think it was Cartoon Network. I'm not really sure. And I was a little older at the time. I had really no interest. I'm like, oh, they're cute. Look, they're little superheroes, right? Okay, so that's my meet cute with the Powerpuff Girls. I don't know much about them besides their name. I've watched less than five episodes, so I'm not even going to pretend like I'm a huge fan and I'm so outraged. No, we just got to look at the cringe. We just have to look at the cringe. It is one big block of, hey, fellow kids. <laughs> like, I just, oh my God, it's so bad. So first off, we're going to talk about why this pilot that was already done was sent back and redone. Now, they don't normally do that. Actually, Naomi, that I talked about yesterday, was greenlit. And and you'll see today, if you go to the CW, they have like a 2021, 2022 little trailer that shows actually a couple little glimpses in it. And I'm impressed. So, not impressed with this. Not impressed with this at all. This is like, What were they thinking? Now, first off, the actress that is playing Blossom is literally the girl, Chloe Quake, from um, Agents of the Shield, right? And I watched the first couple seasons of that. So I watched her progression into Quake from The Hacker and all of that. And I really liked the actress. I thought she was great. I think when you are in that seat, you are that actor, you need to have a little bit of um, clue to just say, hey, I know it's not my job to write here, but what the fuck am I supposed to say? I, I, did she come? Yeah, let's just take a look. First, we're going to look at an article, then we we have to. You know we have to look at it. It's so bad. So these are the alleged leaks. Now, I'm going to be a, a, a little bit careful here because they have been copyright striking a bunch, a bunch of tweets. But I think I'm safe because I'm over here on YouTube. So... They talk about how yesterday we learned that it was repiloted. It was sent back because this aged up Powerpuff Girls was absolutely terrible. Now, the leaked script suggests some of the reason why. And and, and now, this is an alleged leaked script. I want to say that. This could be all false. And if that were the case... They wouldn't be copyright (laughs) striking certain tweets or claiming them and getting them erased. They just wouldn't. They wouldn't care. They would be like, okay, free marketing, right? No. I I would bet that this this is real. So a quick summary of what happened. Professor Utonium, which is played by Donald Fiazan, another great, like, great actor. He is great in Scrubs. I love that show. That show wouldn't work anymore. Because they would always say, like, the black scrubs or, you know what I'm saying? Like, it wouldn't work anymore. You're black? Because last I checked, you had a nerdy white best friend. You enjoy Neil Diamond and you damn sure act like a black guy. And these, my friend, are all characteristics of white guys. Um, And that sucks because comedy's gotten boring. So you got to go to the oldies like scrubs. It's fun. So it's not who who's canonically a good and loving father is now a terrible father who profits off of the work of his young superheroes and spends away their inheritance. Yeah, that's kind of a dick move, right? So Buttercup is queer and promiscuous. We knew that was going to happen for at least one. And they also cut her hair off, unfortunately, because why not? (laughs) Stereotypes, right? Um, Because they're really leaning, and I'm not the only one, really leaning into that unwelcome stereotype. Bubbles is a washed-up child star in a failed reality show, Blossom, which is the girl I talked about. I guess her name's Chloe Bennett. Remains smart and relatively functional. Relatively functional for a grown adult. It it is about the best you're going to get. I'm relatively functional. (laughs) That's debatable. Mojo Jojo is no longer a monkey but a human. That just happens when you grow up. You've never seen a monkey? 
You've never seen a baby monkey grow up? Yeah. They turn into humans. What? <laughs> and his son? And his son is the mayor? So did he have a monkey son and then he grew up to be Ed like his daddy? Okay. And there's a nefarious plot involving mind control device called the woolly bear. Ay, ay, ay. It's so bad. So they go over some of the actual, uh, <laughs> oh, some of the dialogue. But instead of looking at it here, let's look at it straight from the script. And let's hope this does not get copyright strike. I actually had a tweet up with all of these. And when I went to go record, it was gone that quick. It was gone that quick. So luckily I saved them and I've got them. I put them on my drive. So um, bless them. Aren't we here to investigate? Oh, I should. So should have had somebody do this video with me. I'm here to pick up the by curious townies. What? You're here to avoid Drake. Bubbles is here to investigate, but she forgot Butch hates her. Luckily, we're dealing with another hate boner, so alcohol helps. I mean, there's a lot of truth to that, but anyway, so why do you all blossom? Why do you know so much about hate boners? Because life is a big hate boner. Holy fuck, this is like the worst. Di this is worse than Marvel Comics dialogue written by ta Coates. Yeah, it's that bad. Look, we love being Powerpuff Girls, but sometimes we wanted to be other things, like in Dirty Dancing. Okay. Um, Baby wanted to join the Peace Corps, but she also wanted to get a... To what? I should have pre-read these. <laughs> she wanted to be a fancy slut. What's a fancy slut? Like, is that the difference between a $35 slut and... Okay, well, that's a hooker, so... You, you, shut up. Uh, and her dad didn't get it. But, okay, so, uh, uh, all right. So they're heading upstairs where they're hearing bumping sounds. They're hearing their sister get it on. Why are they being a cock bug? Like, honestly, that's stupid. Just go away. Uh, and Blossom opens the door. Why? Do you realize how intrusive that is? Let her finish, fuck. Um, the woman she's had at the bar from the night, they've just finished. So they're all like messy and they just, okay. Oh, fuck. Oh God, I'm sorry. It's fine. Uh, it, knocking. I, I'm just going to tell you right now, knocking would have solved this entire thing, but they got to do that. Oh my God. <laughs> okay. All right. Bla uh, Blast, wake up or we'll leak your nudes everywhere. What are we, 14? Okay, well, no, 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 YouTube. I didn't mean it like that. I didn't mean it like that. What are we, 18? What are we, what are we, young, uh, immature people? Who leaks nudes? Well, uh, some people do, but I'm just saying, that's literally like called revenge porn and you can get in really big trouble. Uh, that worked for you once and your sister is willing to do, what the Fuck. Oh my God. Um, I believe we have two more. Look, we love being pow. Okay, so this is the exact same one. Uh, Blossom's fine. I saw. Okay, so this is Bubbles. Oh, this is the one I actually did read. Blossom's fine. I saw her on Insta. <laughs> she gets updates about her sister on Insta. Can't even say the whole thing. Like, I don't know anybody that calls it Insta. Okay. Instagram, and she has a boyfriend. I saw it on LinkedIn. Nobody uses LinkedIn. Like people do for generally to get a job or something like that. Um, okay. And she got promoted. I saw her on Facebook and she still talks. To, what the fuck? She still talks to grandpa despite their political differences. Why wouldn't she? She would be a terrible granddaughter. Think about that. Despite their, um, what? Of course she does. You imbecile. Like, how could you? Uh, okay. All right. All right. Buttercup. Coming here is probably trigger. Oh my God. This is so bad. This is so, so bad. Bubbles. <laughs> I'm dead. Why? Because she's the one who killed Mojo. Oh, what a fucking cut. I mean, move on org. She, but Bubble says she killed a person. Mojo Jojo. Wasn't that the monkey that they said over here? So Mojo Jojo is no longer a monkey, but he's human. 
So she killed a fucking human being. And she's saying, I mean, move on to org. What the fuck did, were they thinking? What the absolute, this might be just stuff from, yeah, that's my thumbnail. Um, what, what were they thinking? Honestly, this is probably, there's an occasion where I see scripts like that or something that's leaked or I look at, um, generally it's, it, it's comics, right? You can get the old, um, scripts for them. Yeah, never, no, Why? Who's writing this? Is this Jill Blankenship? I wonder if it says. Um, no, I have no idea. But this, this, they make a good point here, right? Um, to talk about aged up superheroes, you have Umbrella Academy as a really good example of what aged up powerful children can do and what they can look like. And it's done really like beyond well, one of the best superhero shows right up there with like the boys, Doom Patrol and Invincible right up there. That good. But move on dot org because Powerpuff Girls are coming to town. I just can't wait until they're going to have. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. So this I, I did have a picture. I don't know if I put it on my thing or not. No, I don't have it on here. So anyways, uh, there, this one's now a lesbian and it, uh, and promiscuous, and we have, I, I just, I'm lost for words. I'm going to end this one because I clearly am not making sense after all of this cringe. I cannot believe it. Anyways, let me know, of course, what you guys think about this. I apologize for the nonsensical video, but my God, the script was nonsensical. Anyways, see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye.